Because if you miss a shot and the ball starts bouncing around all this freaking place, you're not going to be able to do it. Because basically, in order for this to be worth it, you have to be able to make, like, one point at a time shots faster than you could have, like, scored points had you been hopping from platform to platform. So it just depends on what you're good at. This strategy is a lot easier, honestly, just grabbing the ball and tossing it right back in. If you screw up, you can, it can go wrong and you might have to do a level over, but honestly, as long as you don't ever let the ball go past you, and you just kind of grab it as soon as it comes out, and shoot it right back in, wherever. You see, I'm already racking up. I'm at 21 points now. Which is not the highest score I've gotten in the past, but it's decent. See, my high score is 49. I think that was on level like 3 or 4. That was somewhere in the middle. In the middle of the game, I mean. Oops, did I, what did I just do? The ball's trapped inside a closed door. How am I going to get that? Are you freaking serious? Dude, how am I supposed to get that out of there? This is shenanigans. Come on, I can't... Dude, it's locked in there. I can't do shit about this. All I have to do is just wait until the red one or Game game's over. Alright, whatever. Get in there. Alright, let's. I think that I... I think that I got it. So let's just exit. There'll be some lockers that don't open even after you've beaten. Congratulations. Yeah, see? Let's see what the highest reward is down here. Yeah, Ruby Semiconductor. So, it did work. Let's open up all these up and see what we get for beating each of these levels. Yeah, there's a power node there. Awesome. So we get ammo, a power node, a medium health pack, stasis pack, 3,000 credits, and a Ruby Semiconductor. Nice. And, if you remember correctly, we picked up the level 5 suit. Shit. We picked up the level 5 suit when we first came in here, and so, uh, now we have enough credits, I think, to buy it! Which is awesome, because it's the last suit we're gonna get, in the main game at least. There's another bonus suit that you get, like, after you've actually beaten the game, but, nah. That's, 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 you only can use it on your second playthrough, so I don't really count it. I don't think the bats are here yet. You'd hear them crawling around. Yeah, they're here. Okay, get out of the inventory. Where is he? Damn it. Did I miss one of the corpses? Seriously? Yeah, see, this is what happened to me, is that, like, I had missed a few of the corpses, and so I had a bunch of guys on my ass when I turned around. Alright, apparently I missed one of these arms. Just die so I can go for the bat, damn it. Get that health back. Oh, we got him. Yeah, he infected a guy who only had one arm to begin with. Alright. Nice. Okay, well. Alright, well, we finished them off. That wasn't so bad. Yeah, I didn't think the bat was out here yet, but I guess he w he was. <laughs> so, be, be aware that when you come back from Zero G Basketball, the bat will be here. Ruby Semiconductor, I'll sell that. I'll move this. We'll sell the rest of these. Small med pack. Might as well just use that. There we go. And not that. No, no, no. Wrong button. <laughs> I thought inventory in the store, and I, w I went into my inventory, like, standard. Alright, but the schematic should have downloaded there. Yeah, 60,000 credits? We'll buy it right now. You might want to save up a little bit for that. Because, uh, you want to buy the uh, upgraded suits as soon as possible, just because they allow you to carry more stuff at once. And being able to carry more stuff means that you could get more loot to sell, and more money, and thus, thus more power nodes, and thus better weapons and armor, so... Saving money in the end comes out on t you come out on top, and this is our fully upgraded suit, level five. Hell yes, shit's awesome, yo. Yeah, look at this. Look at all the plating and crap he's got on there. He's even got like a thing for his head to rest on. I, I think that appears in level four suit. All right, so I've got oh, lots of med packs. That's good. We're gonna need those. I got some money to buy some ammo, so let's buy some ammo. I'm just gonna stock up and fill up the inventory. Alright, there we go. And we should have enough ammo now for us to last, like, the rest of the game. I don't need to carry that much around at once. Let's go in here and put some of the some of it in the safe. Back in here. Yeah, there we go. We don't need more than, like... Well, I'll take a hundred with me just to be safe. Because some of these areas you can get to a good bit of uh, nasty enemies appearing. Alright, let's make a move on here. I believe where it's telling us to go is up the lift, yes? Okay. Let's do this. Dude, I don't know why, but I got Jungle Land by Bruce Springsteen stuck in my head. Text log, what does it say? 
United We Ascend? Is Unitology a new hope or just another scam? Yeah, it's apparently it's a news article about uh, Unitology. I'm gonna go ahead and save here because I don't feel like dying a bunch more times and then having to like figure out what the hell was going on there and figuring out checkpoints and that sort of thing. So I'm just gonna go ahead and save right there just in case something weird happens with the capture card. So we'll know what happened then. Like all of a sudden, like it just stopped recording and it was like one touch capture card has you know has encountered an error and has to close and it's just like what? So apparently, he's in there, but he won't let us in. That's interesting, I just only went the wrong way, see, we're not supposed to be in here. But, that's interesting, because I just, I just unlocked a little bit of extra dialogue, nice. So if you try to go to that door where he is too soon, you don't have all the, all, you don't have all three nav cards, he, he thinks that, you, first he thinks that you're his wife, and then he says those to go away. When all must seem so utterly hopeless around you. Dr. Cross was a true believer. She had faith. And now she awaits what? her transformation. Her rebirth. Oh, shit. Are you ready to ascend, Mr. Temple? Of course you are. Have no fear. You will play your part soon enough. Witness the conviction of a true believer! You fucking bastard. He just killed Jacob and Elizabeth. They are ready. Take him! Embrace them! God damn it. Now that shit pissed me off even more than I was... Well, I don't know if it was more, but... It pissed me off about as much, about as, much as Hammond dying did. That just that freaking sucks, man. Yeah. And they're in there dead. And he's walking away still. I don't know if there's any way to catch up to him. I don't think that there is. And for some reason, he like manages to like... He manages to leave the room without going out of the only door. So, <laughs> not entirely sure what's happening there. Don't like that sound. Huh. I don't think we get too many enemies appearing in this room. I know we get at least one divider. I don't know if I've mentioned them yet, but the ones that, the little bastards that like break up from the big guy, the tall one that breaks up into pieces. That tall guy is called a divider, and each of the pieces that he produces are called appendages. I don't think we need to do anything about these guys. I think that they just show up. But yeah, he killed Jacob and Elizabeth. That sucks. They're the only two uh, survivors that we've seen, we've even known about. We just heard all their audio logs, remember, back in the earlier chapters? It sucks, man. Alright, let's go down the lift. I think this is where the guy appears here. Just gotta be careful. Got a couple of them too. Damn it, two of these guys? Get the hell away from this. Reload, reload, reload. Go for the lift, go for the lift. Damn it, he's on the lift with me, isn't he? Oh, he fell. I think he fell off. Alright, we're okay. Yeah, see, they're running around down there. I don't know what they're doing. But, uh, oh shit, he won't got up here with me. Where is he? These guys are fast, man. I don't want to get stuck on this. This shit that slows me down and fight these bastards. Yeah, they're climbing the goddamn wall, dude. They're on the ceiling. Jesus. God, man, this sucks. Get out of here. These bastards. Where's the rest of them? This music definitely indicates that they're still alive. There's one. God, they're so damn fast. There, there's another one down. One of them's flopping around all the way on the ceiling over there. Get the hell out of my life. Where is it? Sit still, damn it. There's a third one dead. Or is it? Ah, shit. Get the hell off of me. Ah, oh, dude. I hate those little guys. 
Got at least one more down there. 